groundbreaking products, industry secrets, success stories that help market-leading companies stay on top. I'm Jeff Katroop, Global Program Director for Stratocast, Frost & Sullivan. And today I'm joined by Michael Seifert, uh, CEO and co-founder of Sitecore. Now, Michael, uh, first of all, thanks for joining us. Thank you, Jeff. And uh, great, great to be here with you. As you know, recently I selected Sitecore for an award, a Technology Innovation Award uh, for Customer Engagement Platforms. And we'll, we'll get to that later. But the first thing I want to do is talk about some industry issues and challenges. First one fascinated me. I've heard you talking about this before, predictive analytics. And this is something that companies on the online and digital side of things don't always, uh, it's not the first thing they want to talk about, but it's always very interested. To speak to me a little bit about predictive analytics. It's, so that's a really great question. Um, the term you're using is, is uh, difficult in the sense that analytics in itself is not so interesting. Uh, what interests me more is the idea of uh, prediction. And prediction to the end of self-tuning websites that are able to adjust to provide the customer with an experience that's relevant and immediate in the context of the current interaction. Well, let's talk about, so one of the things at Stratocast that we really like about some of the online and digital platforms, as opposed to some of the other analytics and, and maybe big data platforms, mm -hmm. is that um, some of the other packages, and they do a, a lot of great things, a ton of data, granular data, but it's kind of like they get that analysis done and it's up to you as a customer to decide what to do with it. One of the things we like about the online and digital world is that most of the platforms and products, at least now, are sort of being built from the ground up to analyze, then act maybe in the very next minute mm. or real time. Mm. Talk to me a little bit about how that's maybe a challenge, but really more of a positioning, what companies need to be thinking about with that. So to Sitecore, the, the holy grail of, of where we're going right now is essentially the self-tuning website. So, so what we'd like uh, to see happen is that uh, the website becomes aware of changing trends, uh, changing behavior by the customers, mm -hmm. and is able to, to adapt to them in real time to, to provide the customers with the best experience online. Um, while a number of other companies either go, going by the wayside or consolidating or whatever, mm -hmm. our research has pretty good research that you had, you're highly profitable, you had a great year in 2011. I think the trending is similar this year so far, we'll talk about that, but what I wanted to ask was, and maybe there's some of the globalization, maybe you can talk about that a little bit, but how is the team doing it? How are you and the team doing it? What, if, what impact is going into different regions, I mean, on the ground in a lot of places have? How are you getting there? Yes, so essentially, uh, the way I see it is we're moving along four axes at the same time. Uh, on the one axis is the size of the market. The web content management market is a $1 billion market space. The customer experience management market, which uh, we're moving into, it's, it's a bit undefined still, but it's somewhere between 16 and, and 42 billion uh, US per year. Right, okay. uh, so, so that's obviously a, a big vector. Right. Um, then we're well established in about 60% uh, of the market today, uh, but we're still capturing market shares every year in every market we're established in. On top of that, we have 40% uh, largely untapped uh, geographical expansion uh, st still to come. And, and we're also continuing to, to move up market to, to larger clients. Michael, uh, thanks a lot for being here. Uh, you gave us a lot of great insights and uh, congratulations again on the award. Thank you. Stratocast and Frost and & Sullivan bring you these interviews uh, with movers and shakers, global thought leaders like Michael, who have a lot of innovative ideas and strategies uh, that can help you stay a step ahead of your competition. Thanks a lot for being here.